hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to create the jQuery toggle button the login and registration form I am reloading the browser so now in the login mode notice the button counted is a new user registration so when I want to register click that one notice we are now we are in the registration mode notice the button control value has been changed to if you already register please log in if you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates for this video tutorial I'm using notepad plus plus now in this new one page I'm adding HTML5 code HTML I'm closing HTML I'm adding header section, closing header section. Of that, I'm adding body. I'm closing body tag. Now inside this body tag, I'm adding center tag, closing the center. I'm adding header tag H1. How to create a jQuery toggle button login and registration form horizontal line after the horizontal line I'm adding two div containers div I'm closing this div the second div the first div id is equals to login div and the second div is the registration div now in this login div i am adding the login controls the username and password and one button control field set i am closing the field set legend I'm closing the legend tag so login username input type is equals to text I'm closing the text box control after that I'm adding break the next one is a password input type is equals to password I'm adding break the last one is a button control input type is equals to button value is equals to login I'm closing the button control that's it in the first deal now in the second deal I'm adding the registration details just instead of adding these elements I'm pasting here in the legend I'm adding registration username password read password occupation location the button control I'm changing to registration that's it we have added a simple login and registration form into this new one page after this div I am adding the jQuery toggle button control to switch the login and registration button type is equals to button and id is equals to button toggle I am closing this button tag Now the button control name I'm adding 
new user registration the button name is let's add the horizontal line here now before adding the jquery toggle functionality to this code let's save this file we'll check the basic output on the browser i'm saving this file on the desktop login average toggle jquery jquery.html i'm saving this file let's check the output how it looks at designing part and this is a file i'm opening and here we got the basic output of that code which contains a header login and registration form with the button control now let's add the jquery toggle functionality to this before adding the jquery functionality first we require the latest jquery cdn link let's open google latest jquery cdn google and from the search results i'm selecting the first one hosted libraries in the google hosted libraries notice there is a contents panel here which contains a jquery click that one you can find different types of snippets i'm selecting the latest version 3.3.1 just copy this one add this snippet into our html page in the header section let's write the script script tag i'm closing the script insert the script dollar document dot ready function now my first condition is i want to hide the registration div tag dollar between double quotes i'm adding the div id res div hash dot hide method so after that when i click the button control new user registration i want to display this res div tag and i want to hide this login div tag dollar between double quotes i am adding the button control id hash dot click function now in this click function i'm adding the toggle method dollar i'm adding the toggle functionality the first default i want to display the login due tag comma once a user clicks the button control i want to switch to the registration due tag so let's that add that one res due dot toggle method let's save this file let's check the output this jquery toggle functionality is working or not i'm reloading the browser and notice the registration due tag was in a hide mode when i click this new user registration so notice we got the registration form here when i click it's went to the login page again if i click the new user registration which is a toggle button it switched to the login due tag now my next last target is i want to change the text value if it's in the login i want to show the new user registration when i click the new user registration when in the registration mode i want to show the text value of the button click for login so let's add that functionality dollar between double quotes i'm adding the button control id hash button control id dot text method i want to change the text value so what i'm doing i'm just copying this part 
again I'm adding the button control text double equals to between single quotes if you already register login question mark again single quotes it's a question mark sorry I'm adding the new user registration if it's in the login mode I'm adding the new registration button column single quotes let's add this one that's it we have added the functionality to change the text values of the button using jQuery let's save this file we check the output I'm reloading the browser so now in the login mode notice the button control is a new user registration so when I want to register click that one notice we are now we are in the registration mode notice the button control value has been changed to if you already register please log in that's it